All right. I've got an interesting story about this place right here. My mom and dad moved out here in this neighborhood of 1964. And this was a little restaurant. The thing about this restaurant is, on their grand opening, they had a, a grand opening and someone famous was here. And we got to eat breakfast with him. The famous person was Nick Clooney. I don't know if, how many people over here knows who Nick Clooney is, but Nick Clooney is George Clooney's dad. Nick Clooney worked for the local TV station here. I believe it's Channel 4. And uh, I can remember, I was only about three years old, and they had tables set up right here. And we came down and had breakfast with him. We had pancakes. I remember pancakes. But yeah, it's kind of weird, you know, over the years. Nick Clooney was here. And I bet you George Clooney, uh, George was probably here with him too. George would have been about the same age as me. But uh, it was an ice cream. It was an ice cream store. Ice cream shop. It's been several things since then. It's been a barbecue place, I think, at one time, barbecue ribs. Uh, when I was in high school, I think it was it had turned back into an ice cream place. I can remember, you'd come to the window right here. You'd come right here. Order your ice cream, right? Here in this spot right here. But I bet it's set empty for at least 20 years now, maybe longer, maybe 25 years, 30 years. They've recently came out and they fixed up this corner right here and right there, put a couple of shingles on it. But I remember one time it looked like this and they completely came in and remodeled it, put a new roof on it. I mean, they made it look really nice, but it never opened up. A business never came in here. But anyway, yeah, that's my interesting story. This was our old IGA over here. When I was a kid, that was an IGA. But yeah, Nick Clooney came here and had breakfast with me. And who knows, George Clooney could have been here too. But yeah, he worked for Channel 4. And uh, I guess he would probably go out and do promotional things and... He had his own TV show on Channel 4. It was like a morning show. It came on like every day, I think. If I remember right, I was a little kid. But anyway, yeah, interesting story. This is like in the south side of Columbus. Uh, in a little neighborhood called Southfield. But anyway, this is it. This is my story about this little shop here and the old IGA.